everybody, Brian here. We are two days away, three days away from the uh, first day of 2022. Just want to check in to show you that I uh, want to show you still valid for interactive brokers um, and TWS, Trader Workstation. So uh, if you are new to all this uh, and you want to get a, a uh, history of things that I've done on um, the world of uh, world of um, interactive brokers and Python and all that over the years. Just go to my channel, Quant Labs. Do a search. Type in interactive brokers Python. You'll see some videos here. One year, five years, <clears throat> six months, uh, four years, so on. These are still valid. Um, oh, <laughs> it always helps to transition. My apologies. Just again, type in on my channel, interactive, uh, sorry, uh, youtube.com slash quantlabs, interactive brokers Python. And as I said, you can see here one year, five years, six months, four years, and so on. So, with that, um, if you go on to Google and do a search for um, interactive brokers Python API sample code, I should take you here on the uh, GitHub. Uh, repository for interactive brokers here you have multiple uh, options uh, depending upon your operating system we've got Windows Mac and Unix this is what I'm using because I'm on uh, Linux here Linux Mint so this works just fine you'll download your file and um, just so you know um, what will happen is in the file here when you um, uh, unzip it right here you will get the subdirectories so these are still valid just go under uh, IBT IBJTS samples and if you want Python you can clearly see we have C++ and Java um, I do know they do Excel and some other through the web and whatnot uh, helps again to make sure we got it right so um, you'll Uncompress, unzip this file, go into IBJTS, and then samples, and in my case, you have C++, Java, Python, Python, and then testbed. So here we have multiple sample, uh, and um, the configuration is pretty simple with the TWS. So if you want, just go to Google, type in Python configure TWS for sa API sample code. That will take you to here. Um, here, this repository on GitHub will walk you through how to configure your TWS. So I'm not going to show it because of uh, uh, the TWS software. My system will show my live account, which I don't want to reveal, obviously. Um, but you can follow that. Now, the thing is, um, a lot of the, these uh, code samples I've tried out, namely this one, um, is uh, now a couple things about IDEs, I just use uh, Sublime and run it right off the uh, terminal. So this code sample here called uh, um, called Program will go through and do all test orders of different asset classes. It's still valid. Um, it's uh, 2019 right here. So it all works still. Um, and you can do it right within your Python interpreter or your Python script. So it's still all valid. And uh, I just want to make sure that uh, I test that and uh, update people on that. And that's about it. Talk to you later.